Hi. I'm Manuel Deroy. I'm from Germany, from Cologne, actually. So the reason why we're doing shark tagging is um, that we want to investigate or figure out where our blue sharks go, or better say, if they come back. We are fishing them with an angle and a J-hook and some bait. And then you wait till the shark hooks up. The fishermen and the students bring the shark then on deck. We put more water in its mouth so that the shark can still breathe. Usually the shark relaxes very, very easily, very soon. Then we, we spray, a, spray a little bit of sterile um, liquid on the shark's body. And we make a little about one, one and a half inch incision. And, and this is the incision where the tag later goes in. It looks a little bit dramatic, but the shark the sharks won't feel anything. I mean, you have seen sharks, the shark have bite marks, so the species, the, the individual interaction between sharks is, is actually very aggressive. So the males are kind of aggressive towards the females, in particular if it's about mating. So they bite into the female, basically. That's why females have particularly thick skin and they are, they are, they are tough animals, so to say. And then we take the tag, we make sure that it works. So it's a little v, uh, Vemco V16 transmitter, which can transmit um, to an underwater receiver, which then collects a signal. And um, the tag is inserted into the cavity of the shark. Um, and then we stitch it up. We stitch it up with, with three stitches. That is sufficient for such a small injury. Sharks have a wonderful healing, like a rapid healing process. So everything will heal quite rapidly. So as soon as the incision is closed, um, we are measuring the length of the shark. It's um, very important to have that. And then the shark is um, released as soon as possible in the water again. So this whole procedure takes around five to 10 minutes. And with this tagging, we can investigate if they come back. And if they come back, it could be that it's a very important habitat for the blue North Atlantic blue shark population.